What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Sneakerhead213. Today we have a very special unboxing. I'm very stoked about this unboxing. Been anticipating this order since over a week and it finally came in today in the mail. Um, I did open this ahead of time because I was very excited so I will admit that. But um, this is another boost related shoe. Um, I would say this one was even more slept on so than the human... Uh, race tennis uh, shoes that you guys saw in my previous video um, and I did pick this up from Adidas and it's actually still some few um, adult sizes available if you're interested but today's unboxing is going to be um, over the Ultra Boost Uncaged Parleys uh, nine and a half is my size and these do run true to size I did try them on um, was very surprised on how they fit since it's my first time purchasing an uncaged ultra boost shoe uh, So they do run true to size at least for my feet. I do have very uh, Thin narrow feet um, So if you do fit that description then you might as well go with what I did and which is true to size I have heard some people say go down half a size But it just depends on how you like wearing your shoes and as I always recommend always try the shoe on when you're on at the store if possible um, so yeah, here we go anyways guys, so here it is, the Ultra Boost Uncaged Parley times Adidas Collaboration, very, very cool shoe guys, I mean look at this, I love the color on these, the color is amazing. And it even looks a lot better when the light hits it, like when you're outside. I meant to record this video outside, but I had to run a few errands, so I didn't get to, you know, pretty much do the video outside. But, man, these shoes are very dope. I'm telling you guys, do not sleep on these. The value of these is going to go up. I was talking to a good friend of mine out in Texas. Shout out to him, by the way. He hooked me up with some goodies and uh, he deserves a shout out because he's a really good friend of mine and I like what he's doing with his channel. So his channel uh, link will actually be down below in the description. Um, his name is Kid Kicks and he does reviews on pretty much anything you can imagine um, but primarily shoe reviews. Um, and he's new to the game so show the guy a lot of love if you're interested in um, checking him out. I will post the link down um, for his channel in the description below. Um, so yeah guys, this is the Ultra Boost Uncaged Parley times Adidas and I don't know if you guys are familiar with Parley's um, but that's basically uh, a, co a collaboration they did. Parley is uh, with Adidas and they are partners in the Parley um, Air strategy and this strategy basically means that um, they're out to you know pretty much turn ocean plastic waste into thread that is woven into running shoes which in this case is these the running shoes um and ultra boost and ultra boost x for women but basically um each shoe uses an average of 11 plastic bottles which is pretty um you know uh fascinating to me um so it uses 11 plastic bottles per pair so 11 plastic bottles were used to make these shoes um it also incorporates recycled plastic into the shoes laces um heel webbing heel lining and sock line uh, liner covers so these and then the heel webbing and then also the laces so that's pretty interesting um, also the new additions um, which is the ultra boost on cage ultra boost um, the the ultra boost the one with the cage the 3.0 ultra boost 3.0 and as well as the ultra boost x which is for women um, all of those are actually um, just a few that are in addition to you know the mission of Parley Collection um, and their journey in wanting to create one million pairs of Ultra Boost from upcycled marine plastic. So their goal is to create a million shoes um, from recyclable uh, waste out in the ocean, which is pretty dope. Th this is one of the main reasons I purchased these shoes because of the idea and the concept behind it. So the story behind the shoes. It wasn't so much the look of the shoes, even though the look is an added bonus, it's like the cherry on top. Um, I thought that was very fascinating, so Par Adidas decided to collaborate with Parley again. Um, and one of the things that really strikes me is the color, as you can see, just the color of these shoes. They're very 
very nice i mean they pop there's different shades of blue and a little bit of gray and darker uh blue colors and as well as like a turquoise color back here but anyways let me give you guys a little quick um 360 of the shoe before i start off with the review very cool shoe very very nice there's the bottom okay so let me start off with the outsole so the outsole is made out of continental rubber which is a tire company um it's in triple white that's the only thing I don't like about the shoes. They should have made this in a black, I think, because it'd be easier to keep it clean. Um, the, tor the torsion system, this right here is actually made out of recyclable um, plastic. This plastic in here. So, some kind of um, ocean waste was made out of this. Um, and on the, on the midsole, we have the all-white um, boost right here. It goes from the toe box all the way back to the heel. And all around, as you see there. You also got that little piece of plastic right there. That was also made out of ocean waste. On the back heel, you see that Adidas logo with the parley. And that almost turquoise blue, I want to say. And that's what really makes this shoe stand out. It's like a sky slash turquoise blue. And the parley um, logo there. Um, you also see these wave-like material on the heel here. They are supposed to, you know, mimic waves out in the ocean. And that's really what pops on this shoe, just that little design, that embroidery work. Each line and the space between is supposed to, you know, pretty much represent a wave. And that's very dope. Um, that's a very, very nice um, detail that, you know, Adidas and Parley really put some thought into des the design of this shoe. I really like that a lot. Um, and to be honest, that's my favorite part of the shoe, I won't lie. <laughs> On the upper, we also have, you know, pretty much the regular shoelaces, the flat shoelaces. And some parts of these shoelaces are actually made out of plastic, um, ocean plastic. And that is the shoelace tips. As you can see, they're a little bit darker. And they feel a little bit different, to be honest, than the regular shoelace, uh, shoelace tips on other Ultra Russo Adidas. And it's kind of fascinating to know that these were recycled and it helped save wildlife. But uh, the color is really nice. These actually pop when you take them out in the sun. There are a little bit of hints of dark blue and a little bit of hints of that turquoise or slash sky blue. Flat laces are weaving out, weaving out and in and out from this plastic looking material here in a darker color. There it is again. This is these are airs for more breathability for your foot, so you won't sweat so much. Um, on the front here, we have the three stripes and the darker navy blue here. Really cool um, detail on the shoe box or toe the sorry toe box. We have little holes in here, not holes, but you can faintly see them in there, and that's for more better breathability for your toe. And here we have hints of a dark blue. A little bit of gray that you can see up top there and even some black and some light blues um, it's just a very very detailed shoe the way they did did that to just blend those colors all together is very fascinating to me and it just goes all around the upper of the shoe just all across of all across the upper of the shoe and it's very fascinating to watch how these colors pop out in the day, uh, daylight. There's the holes that I was talking about, and it just goes all across. You see it all across the upper and the toe box of the shoe. And then there's that more of those hints of darker blue and sky blue and even blue colors, all the way up to that sock line. The sock line is also made out of re um, some kind of re recycled material from the sea. I'm thinking maybe um, you know ropes that are used when fishing or something, but that's very dope. It's like a black color in the middle and then like a darker blue there. The insole is pretty cool looking. Let me pull it out for you guys. These are up for grabs, by the way. Um, I had planned to sell them, but 
after I did some research, I was like, you know what? The price is too low for these. I, I mean, I was basically selling these for close to retail. There is the insole. It says Ultra Boost Endless Energy. And the color of it, it's a very light blue to mimic water. There's the other side of the Adidas logo. And then some numeration on there. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this. I really love these shoes because of what they stand for. And then on the inside is the stitching, guys. There's the size. And then there's the stitching on the side. Very cool shoe, guys. I mean, I am not disappointed at all. I really like both the Uncaged and the Ultra Boost 3.0 versions of these parlays. Um, if you guys have a chance to get them, I mean, I totally, totally recommend it, guys. You know, just just go for it, you know. If you like what this shoe stands for, like me, then go for it. You know, it's for a good cause. And that's pretty much it, guys, on the Ultra Boost um, Parley collaboration of the Uncaged version of the shoe. Um, you see how when I turn it and it, the light hits it, that color really pops. And that's how it kind of pops all up on the upper of the shoe when you go out in the sun. So I did try these on. They did fit true to size. Um, if you like, if you have a wide foot, I would go a little bit, you know, maybe up a size. But I really liked how they fit. This part kind of hugs your toes. Um, back here is pretty firm, so it hold, uh, grips your foot. Because there's like an inner lining cage inside here. Back here at the heel tab. As well as up here, guys. There's like a, a inner cage in here. And it just keeps your uh, toes in place. But anyways, guys, enough of that. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this review. Again, shout out to Kid uh, Kid Kicks. Um, I will link his description down below. He's a really good friend of mine out in Texas. Really good kid. Um, does really good reviews. Um, check him out if you're interested. I highly recommend it. And uh, I appreciate you guys' love and support. Comment down below what you guys thought about this video. As well as, um, you know, maybe share my videos. Uh... You know, I'm open to anything. Uh, take care, guys. See you guys on the next review. Peace.